hey y'all welcome back for another video if you're new welcome if you're not new welcome back guys you may not know this side about me but i do love plants i am a plant mom and i enjoy being one as you can see my lily my peace lily i have abandoned it so bad and i thank god that this plant is very forgiving as you can see there's brown tips it's either because I haven't been fertilizing this plant. This plant is very thirsty. It drinks and likes a lot of water. As a matter of fact, as you can see, it's dry. It likes to remain moist. And I haven't been giving it the the water that it's that it needs. So basically, I just totally forgot about my plant. And I'm so sorry, my peace lily baby. So today, what I'm going to go ahead and do is um, give her the TLC that she's looking for. So I start off um, with trimming the ends, but I make sure that my shears are clean because you don't want to create bacteria um, when you're trimming the leaves. So um, I went ahead and cleaned it. Guys, you're not supposed to be cleaning it with your hair conditioner <laughs> but that's what i did i mean it's not gonna affect it at all but whatever so i start trimming the brown um ends or whatever and um just so the plant could look so much healthier because it's like when they have brown ends guys it's like just imagine your hair having split ends if you don't trim those split ends what happens guys exactly your hair is going to continue falling out and it just won't grow the same so that's what you have to do with these leaves, with any leaves on any plant. You got to trim the brown, the brown leaves because it's no longer healthy. And it's a reason why it's brown. It's either because it's not getting enough water or you're overwatering it or it's not getting the nutrition that it needs. So I usually fertilize my um, my um, plants, especially my peace lily uh, with the uh fish um emotion i think that's what it's called it smells really bad guys so i try to figure something out and i start using coffee yes the coffee that you drink and i dilute it with water and i pour it in there and so far so good it likes it likes coffee so i've been doing that um once a week to get it to where it needs to be so it can just get back to its natural state of being healthy again so yes, um, I'm so glad that I got a peace lily because they are forgiving plants, like I said before. So if you're not a plant mom and you want like a plant in the house, I honestly think that peace lilies will be your best bet uh, and pothos. So yeah, um, as you can see, I had a whole bunch of dead leaves, guys. I'm just going around it, making sure that I grab it all and not miss not even one spot. All right, so I'm just going to let you like watch everything i'm done talking but i do want to tell you the next process that i'll be doing so after i'm done trimming the the brown leaves off i am going to spray the leaves because they attract a lot of dust i usually spray it with the um fungal i forgot what it's called um when you have like a type of like insects that's connected to your um that's attached to the leaves to your plants i usually spray it with that but because my peace lily didn't have any um pests on it i just went ahead and used my spray bottle that had my conditioner diluted with water so um that's how i went about that and i sprayed it all over the leaves and then i rinsed it with water and then i watered it and that's it guys that's basically what i do so if you have any questions go ahead and leave a comment down below but don't forget to like comment and subscribe to all my plant lovers i love you and to the ones that are interested and want to know more thanks for watching take care Shine bright up all night We're never slowing down Fall in love, drunk mistakes We're bound to hit the ground Gotta keep this feeling Keep on breathing
Working through 